Slimbo. <laughs> We'll be bigger than anything right now. We'll be greater than anything right now. Swank. Some call your Masa Naba. Listen, I'm the sh Masa Naka. Watch him move on, cause I'm a Shadanka. Well, I'm in one Masa Nasra. Care Matuano, Rasa and Mikra the Sasuano. Who be at the clean toff and Samuel Kellano. Once you know me, Bummy Fellano. Fellana, Papi, I bet the Bum Nerilano. Fellana, Relan and Yami. Fellana, Relan and Yami. This is your girl, Evelyn Kumsen. And welcome to Eve's Eye. If this is your first time coming to Eve's Eye, welcome. And I'm happy you're here. Before you go, like. Subscribe and share LSS, okay? LSS. Okay, so today's vlog is going to be with someone who is gifted. I like his swag, I like his approach, I like the way he is in general. And I got to experience that with him one on one. I was actually going to escort my friend to the Crown Mall, and then, you know, he actually came to come see her. So, without further ado, help me welcome Joe. What's up Toronto? Guess who I bumped into? Isn't it our one and only Tonga? Tonga? So we see you. So what's up, Joey? I'm just chilling, man. I'm, I'm just here. I'm just, I'm I just could, at the mall. At the mall. What did you come to the mall to come do? I came to meet my... My, my your what? Aww. Turn the camera for them to see Okay, me. okay. See who? Me? <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. So um, welcome to Eve's Eye. Oh, thank I'm you. a I'm a vlogger and I'm vlogging my experience in Ghana and you're honestly recognized. You're an inspiration and I love your style. Can you tell me more about your style and what influenced your style? Uh, you know, I'm a, I'm always saying like I'm an I'm a 80s baby. Okay. You know? So everything that I do, I like from through my music, uh -huh. uh, fashion wise, everything is, as you can tell, like I'm a very, I'm a very vintage. Let me, let me just take a full frame. It's just the mall and look at him. <laughs> Okay, continue. You know what I'm saying. So mm -hmm. that's, that's that's just my influence. Your influence. Yeah. Um, do you mind if I ask how old you are? Yeah, 26. You're 26. 26. Okay. 19. 19. Right? Okay. Yeah. Oh, he's almost your whole age. Yeah. Um, are you currently in a relationship? Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah oh, yeah. nice. I'm so happy you admitted this on camera. Yeah. I'll, I'll, there's nothing to hide. Eh? No, that's really. good. So um, uh, I know your music is very influential. It's been going far. And how far do you want to go with your music in terms of Ghana? Um, I'm looking to like you know take getting music like the next level. Like mm -hmm. I feel like mm -hmm. we're not getting there like you know as how we're supposed to you know you know get there and stuff like. Why that. are we not getting there? Is there a reason why? Uh, I think it has something to do with videos as well. Okay, quality. Like, people are in like you know investing in their videos. Okay. Or arts. Okay. Um, Plays like Nigerians are doing better. Yes. And Ghanaian music like we have we have like you know. Very good sound. Okay. But then, like, you're, people, like, people across the globe, that are really, like, mm -hmm. you know, globe really are hearing it. So, if if it's not about the video, mm -hmm. it should be about promotion. But then, at the end of the day, mm -hmm. video promotes the, the music. The music. So, I it's, agree. It still boils down to like. It's video. true. So, if you had an artist abroad, which artist would you work with? Uh, let me see. Let me see. I like how you're thinking about it. It's gonna be deep, eh? <laughs> I'd say. Drake. one thing ever since. Why Drake? Why Toronto? <laughs> <laughs> Why OVO? He, like, I relate to the stuff that he says. Okay. And I kind of have a style at the same time because I, I sing and I rap too. Yes. So, yeah. And at the end of the day, mm -hmm. he's big like that. I mean, he he is. So, um, <laughs> <laughs> okay, so since you're talking to a Torontonian, I'm from Toronto, should we say Drake should work with Joey B, a campaign for you? Yeah, you guys, yeah, of course, of course, of course. <laughs> if not Drake, at least Tori and Tori. Tori Lane. Oh. Tori Lane. Okay, say it. Tori <laughs> Lane. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. All right, so last question. Um, Where do you see yourself? in the future, especially with your music and how influential it is right now? I see myself somewhere that I don't even see myself going. Amen. Like somewhere beyond my <laughs> imagination, eh? I just wanna, I just wanna, I just wanna like promote my music. I just wanna get myself and Ghana out there. Right? Okay. So anywhere, anywhere that God puts me, I'm so happy. Like okay. It really should be 
out there. You know, my imagination. We can see you there and we're gonna <laughs> make sure it happens. Any final thoughts? Yeah, man. Stay true. Yay. Hey. <laughs> I hope you enjoyed it as much as I enjoyed it as well. Thank you so much, Joey B, for coming to Eve's Eye. It's so fun to see young people who want to actually reach out of Africa and make a name of themselves. To be honest, Tory Lanez, Drake, that's big. That's massive. So if you like this page, you like what you saw, do these, do these three things for me. Like, subscribe, and share. You're welcome to when your feet go crazy, crazy. Run up on your chick like baby, baby. My moon number, I'm a frog daily. Busy be the boy, believe in the boy. Really with them boys, I don't wanna sound vain. All my dogs clean, no rabies. Whoever go to see this be what come face me. Are they come? Spray cash on the dance floor. Are they want? See nyash. Boku dance, small. Juna, time, I check. Be the papi, could you come?